It's spring, so we're going to resurrect the old lamb dish, lamb persiade, but we're going to do it in a couple of different ways. Typically, persiade, which is a parsley coating, I'll show you in a minute, is put on the outside of a rack of lamb, rack of lamb being very expensive, and the persiade tending to slide off during the course of cooking. I think we have a solution for that. So we're going to start with a butterflied leg of lamb, leg of lamb that's been taken off the bone. So you have a fairly symmetrical piece of meat here, and what we're going to do is make the traditional persiade coating and use it as kind of a stuffing. And the um, dominant ingredient in persiade is parsley. The uh, name comes from the French word for parsley, which is persil. So into the uh, food processor, that goes with a liberal amount of salt, a liberal amount of garlic, some fresh rosemary leaves. You could use dried if you wanted to and a little bit of lemon zest. And we're gonna need some olive oil here too to get this thing going. I'm gonna use olive oil to the extent that you need it. It's probably more than that. And you want a puree, essentially a puree here, so you can just let the machine run. Little more. Just let it run until it's not doing anything anymore, if the blades are spinning and not chopping. And then have a look. You know, you've got a, a basically chopped parsley, chopped garlic, olive oil. Smell is incredible, as you can imagine. What we're gonna do is just smear that all over one side of the lamb. The smell is just amazing. You could roll this up and tie it, but the minimalist doesn't tie, not anymore. Those days are past, it's too much work. Besides, look, a beautiful sandwich. It'll cook faster this way, there'll be more surface area, more crust, and um, I think it'll be easier to cook too. Little smear on the outside. Some salt and pepper on the outside. onto a rack in a roasting pan. And we're gonna roast this at 425 for, I'm gonna guess 45 minutes, but I'll let you know when I get back. Uh, I said this was gonna be 40 minutes, but that um, well, was 24 hours, which explains the shirt change. No, it was exactly 40 minutes. You know, if that doesn't make your mouth water, you're a vegetarian. I cooked this till it was 130 degrees interior temperature, 125 if you like it really rare. So, and as I said before, some of this is gonna be well done, medium, some is gonna be rare. The persiad is nice and soft, really like a stuffing here. It doesn't, on the outside it crisps up, on the inside, you get this nice little almost pinwheel stuffing. And it's a really nice way to, lovely way to season a leg of lamb Nice and bright, spring-like, tender, easy to roast. You can grill it this way too. It's a winner. And no tying.